YouTube and welcome back to another episode of F is for. So this week F is going to be for two things. The first thing being food and the second thing being frugal because I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make a quick, easy, simple unicorn cupcake recipe. Now I have done some unicorn videos in my past. I made a unicorn buttercream cake and I also made some um, unicorn cupcakes with a fondant. So this is just going to be strictly buttercream. It's going to be no fondant involved. It's going to be very simple to make. And I've had a lot of people ask me the recipe for this one. So today I am going to be showing you guys how you can get it. And if you want to see my other unicorn videos, I will put those in the description box below. So thank you and let's get started with the video. Okay, so I got pink buttercream, yellow buttercream, and pastel blue buttercream. I found these at Walmart for $1.38 and I was super excited because I thought I was going to have to hand mix the colors so when I found these I was so happy. They also come with sprinkles which is really cool because you can always save those for a different project. And with these colors this should make about 12 cupcakes if you're piping a lot of icing on them. I also got some gold candles from my bakery. If you can't find those that's okay. Um, I also got a star tip and some mini marshmallows. So you will need to bake your cupcakes and you will need two piping bags. The first thing I am going to do is I'm going to cut my piping bag in half and I'm going to use that to put my frosting inside of. And for that you just want to make it as flat as possible so that when you roll your bag the icing isn't falling out. So starting with the pink buttercream, I'm just going to scoop the icing in a line and then right next to that I'm going to do the yellow buttercream and then the pastel blue buttercream. Okay, so now that we have all of our colors in a row, just slowly roll that bag kind of in a log shape and then you want to make sure you cut both ends off so that when you put it in your piping bag, you're going to get all three colors. And with our other piping bag, I did put that giant star tip at the bottom so that we're going to use that for the cupcake swirl. Okay, so now that you have your bag filled, I'm just squeezing until I see all three colors. And then you just want to make sure that you're starting on the outside of the cupcake and not the inside of the cupcake. And you're just going in a circular motion with all three colors. And then just gently pulling up and then releasing. And the cool thing about doing the pink, yellow, and pastel blue is that when the colors do mix together, it should make a perfect rainbow. Adding orange, green, and purple. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys in slow motion. That way you can get the whole gist of it. So I'm starting on the outside, slowly going in a circle, overlapping my layers, and then just gently pulling up to release it. And then there's my swirled cupcakes. And now I'm just going to finish icing the rest of my cupcakes. Okay, so now that we have our cupcakes iced, we can then pull out our mini marshmallows. So I'm just grabbing a few out just to show you how the unicorn ears are going to look like. I'm just grabbing one marshmallow and then I'm cutting at an angle in half so that you get that perfect unicorn ear shape. So if you look at it very closely, it looks like little teardrops and those make the perfect unicorn ears. And I just thought this was such a cute idea and this is so much better than trying to roll out fondant when you can just use marshmallows. So 
So once you've added all of your marshmallows to your cupcakes, you're then going to put the gold candle in the center to represent the unicorn horn. And if you don't have the gold candle, just go ahead and buy a unicorn kit at Walmart. They're only like $4 and they come with the ears. So here's my final product and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. my video if you liked it give it a fat thumbs up a juicy thumbs up you can subscribe to my channel you can comment below and you can always reach out to me and do all that good stuff and thank you bye